Hello, welcome back to um, San Herrera. We are in episode 10 today. Um, there's a lot I want to do in this episode. Um, I might not get to it all uh, th th uh, this time, but I want to try. So one of the first things I want to point out is... Um, I think it would actually... I could probably still bring a... A, uh, a train station through here if I if I uh, elevate the track or uh, lower it underneath this road I could still fit it back here and then I could raise it above the, the highway and bring it bring it down and take it through here so in order to do that I'm gonna have to destroy these roads which I don't mind doing honestly and then I can bring these ones down as well So that was the first thing I wanted to do. Second thing was I looked at our budget, our health panel, and um, our six citizens is about five. We have about 5,006 citizens and it's growing. And our heal capacity is only 1,900. So that tells me we need about like five more hospitals. So I think we're going to start a medical district in today's episode. Um, As for, as for where we're going to put this, I think we're going to put it somewhere over here. So we're going to take this up. 37. How much was that? 37.20? Yeah, 3720. We don't have to make this too nice right now. I just want to make it a uh, functionable. And we're going to start off by playing this general hospital from the, I believe it's the Japanese content creator pack. Uh, we will reorganize this, this in the future, but for now we just need to get this placed, the medical laboratory. Um, and let's get some water underneath here and get this. And then electricity. Yes, we need electricity over here. And then we need to get an extra hospital over here as well. Or an extra two, I think. We'll put one of each. We'll put one from the... Put one of these ones. As well as... One of these ones. We will also place <clears throat> we will also place a crematorium in here. Okay, our capacity just went up by, uh, no, 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 it didn't, uh, wait, look at our healthcare, just went up quite a bit, so we're gonna place, you know, we're gonna make a one-way road through here to make this flow better, because we are having dozens of ambulances now, so let's pause it real quick, and Get these junctions fixed so we don't have tons of traffic through here. That would not be good. 
with all these ambulances. Um, and then, yeah, there's tons of traffic through here now, so <clears throat> we should probably also get a, yeah, we still have good, uh, So over here, I think we're going to just place, um, how much does this cost? We should probably place like three more hospitals over here. <laughs> Let's see how much our capacity went up. Now we have enough. Hopefully it doesn't go up any higher than it already is or that would be bad. <laughs> we just placed four hospitals over here. All right, hopefully that will uh, fix fix some of our problems. Just to stay ahead of it, we're gonna pl place another <clears throat> another thing right here. All right, one other thing I wanted to do was over here. I think over here we could put a little public transportation district. And what I mean by that is I think, um, so if we're to bring the track over here and bring it through here, I think we can also get one to come over here, and then I think we get a passenger train station over here. Um, <clears throat> I apologize for uh, for my allergies. I still have allergies, um, so or we could put this. I want to get this replaced. Um. Move this closer to the road so we can fit a road back here. different with this I guess um, oh wow we don't have power back there whoa what happened oh oops <laughs> that was a mistake Not sure where else to put this warehouse. <laughs> now we have a lot of traffic over here as well, and I'm hoping mo I'm hoping that most of this will clear up over time. <laughs> I'm not sure what most of this. I think most of this is just residential traffic moving in. Yeah, so. Hopefully that will fix. <laughs> so many ambulances, this is insane.
well, this is probably one of the uh, one of the craziest sick waves I've ever, I've ever seen. So. Oh, we already have tracks. I did not. I did not know that we already had tracks. That's interesting. I don't think we can connect it up, can we? We don't have any connection to a railroad. How can we already use tracks? Right, there's no connection anywhere. Yeah. That's a little bit weird. A little bit weird. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get this. We're gonna create a track for this. We're not gonna. It's not gonna function yet, but we're gonna create it just so that way we know what we're working with. So I don't want to at grade crossing at level crossing over here with this. <clears throat> um, station or with this uh <clears throat> with this road because of how close it is to a. Uh, how close it is to the... Is that too steep? Yes. So I don't want an accurate crossing there because of how close it is to the... Um, how close it is to the highway. That would cause issues down the line with traffic. Let's see if we can go down a little bit less... Okay, <clears throat> it's gonna be a little bit harder than I thought it was. Um, you know, maybe what we could do. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not liking this alternative too much. So let's just... It's alright if it's a little bit ugly, I guess. Uh, let's see if there's if we can bring this back any farther. We can. It's going to be steep. That's all right, I guess. It's not ideal, but there's not much else I can do about it. Is there no way I can bring it back a little bit farther? No, I can't. Okay, so let's bring this up. Um, <clears throat> you know, actually, it's probably not safe to have it so close to that area, actually. In the residential area, so we're going to bring it down. Or we're going to bring it... We're going to bring it down. We're going to um, kind of turn it a little bit up here. Bring it up. And we're going to destroy these houses. So 
I'm not sure if we should, um, yeah, I can imagine that the railroad would have been here first. Um, we're going to dezone this. I don't think anybody wants to live on a railroad track like that. So I'm not sure. I, th I feel like the railroad would have come first. Um, it absolutely would have come first, actually. <coughs> Railroad probably would have been one of the first things to be in this town um, in terms of transportation. So I think maybe we'll try to. Could we bring it around this, maybe? I'm trying to do this without it looking totally. totally, uh. totally weird. I don't see a ton of options. Let's see, actually, let's see if we can bring it through here. Let's bring it up. Where can I bring it up? I can. That. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see if I could. I can. I'm not sure if that's too low. I don't think it is. That is good. That is good. I didn't think that was going to work. Okay, now let's bring the railroad. <laughs> I think we're gonna <coughs> we're gonna make a bridge right there, so that way we can. Um, we don't have to cross the uh, the road and cause traffic. Uh, I'm not sure if we can actually tunnel this. Yeah, we can't. So let's bring it back a little bit. And there we go. This this is exactly what I wanted. Actually, no. Let's let's curve it around. Actually, let's use our freeform tool. And just to dec decrease traffic, I think we will use... Uh, let's get this fixed up, actually. Let's get this connected. And that is very way too steep, so we're going to bring that down slowly instead. I'm very happy that this worked. I did not think that was going to work the way it did. 
And there's another house getting built here. Why is it? Oh, it's never mind. <laughs> it won't be there for long. <laughs> okay, so now let's let's start working on a public transportation. Oh, there's still many sick. Let's see. Let's check our health. How's our how's our thing doing? We still have five thousand six citizens. <laughs> so our hospitals aren't doing very much. Look, we have five over here, and they're not even... Yeah. Okay, that's... That's not cool at all, so... <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what to do if, if that many hospitals aren't doing anything. I think the only other alternative would be to place, like, five more of them or something. <laughs> Okay, so as far as the public transportation, I think I want to try to place a inner city bus station. Um, I wanted to do one of these. Yeah, I wanted to do one of these ones. Make sure you're using the right roads so that we don't got something weird going on. You know, I'm wondering if maybe yeah, I'm gonna bring this back. I'm gonna I'm gonna move this because I think that this would be good commercial land. I like the look of these buildings over here. I'm gonna make these historical. So, um, with how, without like the, the, the shore, the, the, the coast right here, I think this would be a good spot for commercial or a uh, residential instead of, uh, a big transportation hub. So we're going to move, <clears throat> we're going to get our power lines connected up. Oh, they still are good. Make sure we have water over here. And then for trains, we have these nice stations. I definitely don't think we're going to use all those, but... And you know, I'm wondering if it'd be a bad idea to place. Hmm, let's let's see how this would work. See if I can fit it there. Not quite. So one, one side is for the track and one side is for the metro. So if I was going to get this to work, I would need to switch it around. Why is it? Hmm. 
just keep this uh, normal road because I think it'd be kind of weird if we had this just random uh, if we just had like random trees right there and we've got this really bad slope I don't think there's much I can do about that unless I took this whole part of the road down which I might do There we go, and then connect our highway uh, exit back up and entrance. Yep, that's nice, okay. So now we can get this connected up to very sharp. I'm not sure how efficient that would be if that would even... It'd probably be good for it to be somewhat sharp though, just so that way the trains have no option but to slow down because trains would absolutely slow down uh, in an area like this to get to the station. So let's see. <clears throat> okay, and then for these elevated metro. Um, we already have a station. I want I want to do some metros though. So as far as where the stops would go, right here is good. Right there. Um, then we're also doing going, uh, what is this, e I believe this is east, west, towards the ocean. Slope is too steep, that's interesting, so. Oh, okay. Oops, I forgot about our tracks that we have there, so that might not work. Yes, so let's, we need to bring it closer so we can bring it down. We're going to use some, uh, eminent domain to build this, which is a bummer, but I don't think we have much of a choice because we can't put it anywhere else.
What do you mean slope too steep? How is that too steep? Is it that? No, it can't be that deep. Hmm, <laughs> okay, well. For now, this will be our our line. It'll it'll probably get bigger than this, but for now, we'll just keep it as this. So then we have this. <coughs> no. Uh, where this? No tram. Where's our trams? Uh, not trams. It's, uh, metro. That's. So we're gonna change this to. What's this road called? Does it say? I think this is Parker Road. We're gonna uh, Parker line no 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 it's Freeman <laughs> yep yeah, so I think now we can probably we probably need to work on public transport a little bit more because we've grown the city significantly since we last looked at it so let's look at our buses we have this bus line So we got some weird things going on here. I don't really know what this is. <laughs> I'm afraid to interrupt it though because... Okay, that did not work the way I wanted it to, and now we're having some issues. And it's going all the way on the highway for no reason. How do we delete this stop? <laughs> no, I don't want it to do that. Why is it... Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to do. Oops, no. Um, so now with the train lines, um, let's bring these up over the highway. Or we could go under if it's not enough room, or we could just bring it up higher before.
Hmm. I'm going to bring it back a little bit before. Or bring it up a little bit before. <coughs> And it's switching heights a little bit, so we're going to make sure that doesn't occur again. We're going to keep it the same height, so go up one. Is that is that good? Yes, it's, I think it's just because the... Uh, oh, this is going to be hard with the snapping. Is it not straight? <laughs> So we're going to have them come in here, and they're going to come out this end right here, the sharper um, curve, and then we're going to bring this road down, this uh, railroad. Okay, and that was, uh, that is really good. I really like how this turned out. Um, so let's continue to bring this. Let's, yeah, okay. And then we just have to wait to be able to connect it up over there. Okay, now it wants us to do some more. Honestly, I don't think we need this anymore since we have... This one over here. Yeah, we don't really need that one anymore, so either we'll, we'll relocate this one or we will completely destroy it. So let's see where else a good spot would be for this. Um, maybe over here? Yeah, we'll just destroy it for now. Or actually, is there a way we can just turn it off? <coughs> There is. So we're just going to put this out of the way for now. Let's put it over here. I'm not going to be using it. And then over here we will we will develop over here actually. Um, there's like almost no sick people over here anymore. This is good. Wow, the uh, ambulances are doing their job. That's Let's look at our health uh, panels real quick. Oh, it's going up still. Huh. <laughs> We're not seeing significant issues anymore, though. Which is a really good thing. So let's zone some commercial along this collector. Demos on most of this other space to be residential. Who doesn't want to live next to a hospital? And then over here, we'll fill that in, dezone that little tile right there. And Um, let's get some paths in here because there's a lot of 
big. Unnecessary gaps. So right there we'll get one. And then right here we'll also get one because there's no reason that you should have to cross the entire block just to get across. <laughs> that, that shouldn't have even been there. I'm not sure why that house was even there. Um, and then... Okay, <clears throat> and I'd also like to upgrade some of these roads to have bike lanes. Uh, do we have that? Where is it at? Oh, there, uh, yes. This is a little bit of a tedious task, but it'll uh, it'll get done. We're about uh, yeah. There we go. There we go. <laughs> and let's make sure we have our encouraged biking policy over here. Oh, we didn't put any policies over here yet. So let's put smoke detector distribution. Uh, free recreational recreational use. We don't really have a lot of recreation over here, so we'll just leave that out and then. <laughs> Um, for-profit education. Yeah, we'll do that. City planning, we will use high-rise ban, uh, encourage biking, and I think there's not a lot of heavy traffic through here anyway, so I think that that's fine. destroy these and you know I actually kind of want to zone right here next to the train track just to about there because um, some family of mine used to live next to a like right next like right in front of a railroad track and it was always it was always fun just uh, I mean, it was loud, but it was uh, it was kind of cool to hear the trains at the same time. So, so I want to re I want to try to recapture that <coughs> in city skylines, and we don't. I I think that house right here wouldn't be worth much, so we'll just take that out. This isn't necessarily a high-income neighborhood, but it's also not a low-income neighborhood, so... I guess just middle class, probably. Um. <laughs> and I think that our ambulances are finally doing their job. It's, it's like, a it's not very many sick people anymore. Okay, and I want to get part of this district uh, developed as well.
So I'm debating with whether or not I make this into a park or if I make this into a neighborhood. That was weird. Did you guys see that? Over here, that was weird. Um, probably just a glitch. I get all kinds of glitches when I'm playing with mods. And we're not we're not playing with too many mods right now. There's just enough. Like sometimes when I uh, load the save, um, none of the buildings load. Like it's just, you just see the the, uh, the slabs. You don't see any of the actual uh, buildings. So I have to reload the uh, reload the entire thing. We're having trouble with our electricity. <laughs> Let's take care of that real quick. We have our Public Works campus over here. Public Works campus. And we're going to place... Yeah. Let's get rid of this old one. We don't need this anymore. Uh, electricity. You know, is it just me, or I really don't like this asset very much at all. It looks really ugly, and I don't think I've ever seen any res or commercial building that looks like this. I've always found this asset very ugly, especially from far away. Just uh, and plus, I mean, for a low density building, I feel like it's kind of big. I mean, this is like like even this one's big, but this one's like. A lot taller than this one. So yeah, I've never really liked that one, but it is what it is. <laughs> um, okay, so I think we're going to call it an episode soon. We did a lot in this one. We grew our population, started the medical district. Uh, let's see if there's any... Yeah, we can get this one. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're still seeing tons of traffic through here, and I don't think our... Oh wow, yeah, we have a lot of less. It's definitely working. It's working slowly, but it's working. <laughs> That's good. Um, oh no, no, no. Why is there so many buses? Are these all full? Wow, they are. Wow. Okay, so we have three buses right there, and most of them are full. Tons of traffic. Oh yeah, this is probably a lot of residential tra residential traffic from people moving in. So that's understandable. So as for this, what this part of town is going to be, I think this is going to be downtown. So I think this is going to be the downtown section of whatever Parker Hills. I think it's going to be downtown Parker over here. Um. So I think we're going to put a library over here just because we don't we only have one in the entire city and it's over there. So let's get a library in here. So whenever people move into the city, you generally see tons of traffic coming in. So this is understandable, honestly. I'm not surprised by this. And I was right, this cleared up. So I bet you I bet that this entire backup that was happening here was just residential traffic from um people moving in. We have a building underwater. I'm gonna see if I believe I can grade this. I don't like how high that is. That was actually one I did I uh 
after the last episode I came in here and did some manual or some just changes to this um, just over here in this area I really want to make this a friendly area and I don't think that it's gonna be that if we uh, if we just have these uh, really sharp drop-offs right at the beach right on the edge of the paths so our population is growing again we have about 23,000 people now um, so that's really good let's see if this line is getting used 30 out of 30 11 out of 30 so as long as we have some empty buses that's all right um, I'm not sure why there's no demand for in industry at all like we, we just keep adding people to the city and there's no demand for industry and there hasn't been for a while um, I want to make this to uh, Fahrenheit because uh, this is in America we're not in uh, Europe is this one of those uh I think this is one of the buildings that comes in the uh, the DLC for the University City content creator pack, and this one as well. I thought this was an asset from the workshop. This is a nice asset, though. We're gonna make this a historical building, and this one too. We're going to speed it up, see if traffic will clear up. So many ambulances. Probably hundreds. Let's see how many each one has. 38 ambulances, 38 ambulances. They're not even using their ambulances. That's a little bit uh, discouraging. We just placed this for the ambulances and it's not even using them. Yeah, this one's about full. 20 out of 38 ambulances in use. 30 out of 33, 32 out of 38. 16 out of 38. So as long as we have some spare ambulances, because these ones are actually about full. These uh, hospitals. <laughs> so we might need to place another one soon. We having water issues? No, we just forgot to bring this up. We're having death care issues as well, so let's get a cemetery um, or a crematorium rather in this area. We don't have one around here. Is this an inner city bus or why is this? Why was it taking the highway for? Don't know why it's taking the highway. Um, so there's still tons of there's just there's ambulances everywhere at this point. Let's let's look, let's look at this. If we click on this, we can see all the purple vehicles. Our ambulances and there's probably one on every single corner of the city I mean where there's sick people at least <laughs> I think this just went up actually I'm not sure well hopefully this will uh, this is working slowly but surely I think it's working Probably place one more hospital at this point. Wow, just look at those. They're just pouring out like nothing. I 
Honestly, I'm not even. I'm pretty sure that after we finish, after this is over, we're probably just gonna destroy all these. I can imagine that in a big epidemic like this, the city probably would have spent years, or not years, uh, they probably just would have spent a lot of money on hospitals, tem or temporary hospitals. We're gonna get these abandoned factories destroyed because they're not doing anything anymore. And I think we're going to call it an episode soon. <laughs> Hopefully this area will redevelop. I can imagine that the only reason it went abandoned in the first place was probably because everybody got sick so nobody could come to work. But I could be wrong about that. Um... So hopefully in the next episode we're going to develop along here, and then uh, hopefully we can buy a tile after that. <laughs> and you know what? Let's actually let's zone in here a little bit. I want to make this. I want to make some of this in here commercial, but we can start zoning. We relocate these. Do we, do we lose the patients that are in there? I want to see. So we're just gonna move this one. Oh, good, we don't. So we're gonna move all these over here onto this road. So in, a, <clears throat> in the uh, older American cities, whenever you had a, a grid that had a weird sort of angle to it, and the grid met up with each other, the grid would kind of, um, like it would just, it would completely just meet with the other one, even, uh, even if it wasn't at the right angle. So you'd have like, so you'd have these weird kind of blocks in some areas. And it's really hard to capture that in this game just because, um, for instance, you can't always make a connection like right. Like I can't even make that connection, so we're just gonna leave that there. But like, so you'd see roads coming up through here, and even if it's at like a really weird angle where you're gonna have like a, a really weird crossing, they're still gonna they're still going to have the um, the road go through. We're gonna zone most of this to be residential. And we'll probably make this into a park in the future, but for now, we're just going to, I think we're going to call it an episode soon anyway, so I'm just going to zone this and we're going to, we're going to end it. So I think I'd also like to, yeah, we're going to finish this. Uh, actually, we're going to create a new district for downtown in this area. Um, so we're going to name this real quick. Parker, downtown Parker. No, actually old, old town Parker. As for our policies, we'll get some policies in here. We'll get... High-rise, bent, heavy traffic, but no, let's do, do smoke detector distribution, education boost, and for-profit education. Um, there was something I did over here, and I 
didn't really know what the policy did so filter industrial waste I usually filter industrial waste I believe that's yeah and this is more for a um, industrial uh, park so I'm gonna apply this over here instead I didn't really know what that was for I thought it meant that uh, like in the water it would drain it would keep the pollution out of the water if that was uh, able to happen so I, I applied it over here because I didn't want uh, polluted water over here I didn't know that it was just for resident or for industrial uh, districts so we're gonna rename this also we're gonna call this the crystal industrial park uh crystal uh yeah crystal shore um and we're going to name this we're going to change this to the crystal um crystal parks no crystal estates we already have crystal estates. So we're going to make this and do crystal No, no, no. Um Yeah, we're going to just do crystal parks. Um And then uh, I think I want to apply high-tech housing over here maybe. There's some crazy things going on with the grade, um, but I think that's honestly common in cities like uh, New York. I'm not really sure why we're just getting all these massive population demands. We're about 24,000 people. We're going to call it an episode. Let's check how our health is doing real quick. Yeah, we're growing. These sick people are um, not decreasing, so that's not good. I think so. Yeah, look, we're getting more sick people. <laughs> why is it? Why is it not working? I don't know. Um, so yeah, thank you for joining me in this episode. We uh, we filled in this area. We added a cargo station through here and added a, a little. Um, I don't even know what you call it. A um, public transport district, and then. We added a little uh, medical district over here, which I'm planning to hopefully change in the future. This is just kind of, I just wanted the places for, for the for the uh, big epidemic we're having right now. But hopefully in the future, uh, we will make this into a nicer medical district and we'll have a, um, just a nicer area over here. So um, along here, just so I don't forget, there was something else I wanted to do as well. So I'm going to make this into a nice neighborhood, but I also want to apply... Uh, one of the specializations for commercial over here, which is the, uh, what, which one is this? Uh, tourism, but yeah, we're gonna do tourism. Um, and we're going to apply high tech housing over here. And over here as well. Um, yeah, we'll apply it over here as well. Yeah, we already have it. Never mind. All right. So thank you for joining me. Um, we did a lot in this episode. Uh, I will see you guys in the next one. And, oops. NJH is out. <laughs>